According to Warren Buffett, the number one rule of investing is never lose money and the number two rule of investing is never forget rule number one. So this week, I've taken it upon myself to take Warren Buffett's wisdom into action. And when it comes to investment, how do you not lose money? One of the ways that you could prevent yourself from losing money, not entirely 100%, but reduce your chances of losing money is to diversify your portfolio and you could do this through a couple of different ways one of the ways is through an index fund or an etf so with index funds and etfs these are like baskets of stocks that are put into one that you can buy for a fraction of the cost so this week i've decided to add a couple of etfs into my dividend portfolio hello and welcome to the channel my name is abdul on this channel, I talk about dividend investing and personal finance. I am taking you along a journey of me trying to grow passive income through dividend investing on this channel. I also talk about personal finance, like I said, uh, such as how to make money, how to save money. And so if these are topics that interest you, do me a favor, subscribe to the channel to follow along the journey. If you have questions, let me know in the comments down below. I will be sure to get back to you as soon as possible so here we are week three of the dividend investing challenge and the portfolio is sitting at three hundred and twelve dollars and ninety eight cents um, so since this is week three and I'm investing hundred dollars every week of the three hundred and twelve dollars and ninety eight cents I've actually only invested uh, three hundred dollars of actual cash into it so the market gains that i've had so far i guess based off of that then is 13 dollars and seven cents which comes out to 7.65 percent in returns so far which is absolutely crazy the market is going absolutely bonkers right now if you are paying attention uh and if you are not well now you know the market is doing absolutely amazing and my portfolio is doing pretty well so that's some positive news um and talking about dividend investing challenge i actually received my first dividend this week so as you guys saw last week i bought uh was it apple that i bought yeah last week i bought apple and um one of the reason why i had bought them was because at the time last week was because they were about to announce uh they had their yeah, ex-dividend date was coming which means that if you had bought the stock before that date you were going to get that dividend and so i had bought before the date so which is why i got that dividend um so let me see if i could find that for you guys let's go to activities oh yeah so here we go uh, actually, I got two. Oh my goodness! I actually got two dividends. I didn't even notice. So over here, you see, on August fourteenth, twenty twenty, I got two cents dividends from O Realty Income Corp. So that's from uh, the, my realty uh, real estate um, portfolio, and then uh, the Apple, which I know was gonna come, um, and that was twenty three cents. And as I had mentioned to you guys last week, um, when I was trying to do the math, I told you guys that it was going to be an 83, I believe, yeah, 82 cents, I believe it was, or 83 cents dividend that they were going to be given for every one share. And since I only owned one fourth of that um, uh, Apple stock, I was only going to get somewhere around 20, 20 cents. And in this case, that's exactly what I got. I got 23 cents in apple dividends um so that's pretty exciting and um so yeah so so far i've got four uh, 23 cents here two cents here so that's about 25 cents in dividend so far which is absolutely amazing um so i'm pretty psyched for that um i mean this isn't the first dividend that i've received but this particular uh channel is geared towards just showing you guys the journey of how these things work you know pretty psyched up for that uh, 23 cents I didn't have to work for it I don't work for Apple um, and basically they just gave me a raise in a way right 
So that's the power of investing. Okay, said, so what did I actually buy this week? Um, let's get into the nitty gritty of the portfolio. Um, so yeah, like I said, this week I've decided to take heed of Warren Buffett's um, wisdom, which is to make sure that you do not lose money. And one of the ways to do that is to diversify your portfolio. And you could do that through buying index funds or ETFs. So in my case, I've decided to buy some ETFs. <clears throat> and so what are the ETFs that I bought? I bought uh, VYM, which is the Vanguard High Dividend Yield uh, Index Fund. And then I also got some VTV, which is the Vanguard Value Index Fund. Um, and then VTI, which is the uh, Vanguard Total Stock Market Index Fund. I got the IVV, uh, AGG, and BN, BND. And BND is the Vanguard Total Bond Market. Okay, so that is basically that. And each of these, uh, the targets for them uh, were 20%, 20%, 20%, 15 15 and 10% the bonds i bought these stocks yesterday and that already some of them are already up so we got what three of them are already up and two of them are in the red already so which isn't so bad uh two cents lost two cents lost um and then 11 cents gain 11 cents gain two cents gain one cent gain um so that's not pretty bad at all so that is pretty much it for this week the takeaway for today is Follow Warren Buffett's rule of investing. Rule number one is never lose money. And rule number two is never forget rule number one. And the way to do that is to diversify your portfolio. And you can do that through buying index funds or ETFs. Okay. And so that is what I've decided to do this week. I'm buying some ETFs to cover my basis. Even though the markets are doing pretty well right now, I will say do not get caught into what in the investment game they will call irrational exuberance by thinking that things are going to keep going up and you get caught with your pants down you buy certain stocks that were just going up and up and then all of a sudden those stocks are like tumbling down you know you don't want to do that so anyway i hope you got some nuggets of information off of this video if not my apologies wasting <laughs> if not my apologies for wasting your time <laughs> but i hope i hope that i did not waste your time um if you find any useful information in the video make sure to give it a thumbs up like the video share it with someone um subscribe to the channel and the motto around here is stop waiting start doing go out there start opening these accounts i got links in the description you can open your own M1 Finance account or Robin Hood's account and start investing today. Okay, so until next time, stop waiting, start doing, and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Peace and love to all of you out there.